The Embroidery Guild at Derby Cathedral is a group of very dedicated uh, ladies who gather once a week and sometimes more than that to embroider new vestments for the cathedral, altar frontals, lectern and pulpit falls and also do commissions from other churches and some of their work is, is, com is, is completely outstanding. As you'll probably realise we have all sorts of different colours for the seasons of the year. We have green, red, purple, gold and white and they embroider gold, crosses, uh, chalices, all sorts of things, you name it, they embroider it. And it's so time consuming and to see them work on a Thursday with all the delicate work is, is absolutely inspirational. Well, I've been at the cathedral now nearly three years and, and I've been involved in the design and also helping the people of the embroidery group to make a new set of green vestments, which is a chasuble for the president of the Eucharist a dalmatic for the deacon and a tunicle for the subdeacon. Uh, it's a beautiful shade of green um, and the design of the, of the dalmatic and the tunicle are outstanding. We, re we are redesigning the chasuble uh, to put a gold cross on it, uh, but from a distance, you know, we've had so many comments of how striking these vestments are. And to see these ladies working um, timelessly away at, at embroidering these vestments has been a real inspiration. We live in a technological age, the age of the computer, and it's a breath of fresh air on a Thursday morning to go into the cathedral and to see a dedicated group of ladies working with needles, with cotton, with all the things that take us back in time, all the things that used to happen many, many years ago before the technological age. And it's so creative, it's exciting, and the, th the sort of things you can't do on a computer these ladies wear their gifts and their skills. Well, that's where the work takes place here.